<laughs> now to some fun. The ninth annual River Rat Race, say that five times yeah, fast, yeah. hosted more than 150 swimmers this morning. Big time stuff. News Channel 9's Betsy Golden followed the uh, swimmers as they made the hour long journey down the Tennessee River. As the sun was coming up this morning, all these swimmers were getting ready to jump into the Tennessee River. It was the ninth annual Chattanooga Rat Race Open Water Swim. Nine years ago, there were only 17 swimmers in the water. Now, more than 150. Those in the white caps going 4.5 miles. The swimmers in the pink, 2.4. This is only the second one I've done, so I'm really not sure. I mean, I don't really know how to judge it. It's just hard for me to get used to doing the, like, I can't see in the water, and I'm used to swimming in a pool, so. But it was good. It was really, it was a lot faster than I thought it would be. Everyone had to complete the race in under three hours. Uh, if the current is really strong, we have had somebody finish in about an hour and 10 minutes. Uh, normally, it's closer to an hour and a half to an hour and 45 minutes for a pretty strong swim. The swimmers were raising money for an inner city lifeguard training program. So far, they've had almost 20 students go through the program in Chattanooga. We uh, have a scholarship fund, uh, and we're expanding that a little bit this year to not just do lifeguards, but also to train teachers to teach people how to swim. And for those of you who want to swim but need a little extra encouragement. Just get out there and do it. It helps if you have training partners and if you're consistent. Betsy Golden, News Channel 9. Thank you, Betsy. And if you enjoy swimming and uh, want to get involved in any way, shape, or form, the Chattanooga River Rats provide early morning workouts for swimmers here in the Scenic City area.